Hi, welcome to Sunil Maths Tutorial. In this video, we will learn about moments of binomial distribution. So before going to see the moments, let us see the definition of binomial distribution. In the previous lecture, we learned about this. A random variable capital X is said to be follow the binomial distribution if it assumes only non-negative values and its PMF probability mass function is given by probability of X is equals to X is equals to P of X is equals to ncx p power x q power n minus x for x is equals to 0 1 2 and so on small n where q is equals to 1 minus p 0 otherwise the two independent constants n and p in the distribution are known as parameters are known as parameters of the distribution so a random variable capital x is said to follow the binomial distribution if it satisfies this definition p of uh, probability of uh, x is equals to small x it is equals to p of x it is equals to ncx p power x q power n minus x where x varies from 0 to n and q is equals to 1 minus p 0 otherwise right let us see the moments of binomial distribution case one non-central moments case two and central moments right the first four moments non-central moments the first four moments about origin of binomial distribution are obtained as follows in this video we discuss about both non-central and central moments in the first case we discuss about non-central moments the first four moments about origin non-central moments means there must be an origin so the first four moments about origin of binomial distribution are obtained by using this formula mu1 dash is equals to expectation of x is equals to summation x is equals to 0 to n x into ncx p power x q power n minus x remember this point mu1 dash is equals to expectation of x is equals to summation x is equals to 0 to n x into ncx p power x q power n minus x so what is ncx ncx we know that binomial coefficient ncr formula by using that formula it can be written as n factorial by n minus x factorial into x factorial n factorial by n minus x factorial into x factorial and p power x can be written as p power x minus 1 into p this p power x can be written as p power x minus 1 into p now in the denominator we have x factorial that x factorial can be expressible like this x into x minus 1 factorial x into x minus 1 factorial and also the numerator n factorial can be written as n into n minus 1 factorial n into n minus 1 factorial now you observe that this x and x get cancelled and both in the denominator and in the numerator x get cancelled and n is a constant and independent of summation right outside we get np np summation x is equals to now it is various from 1 to n because it is not valid for 0 if you substitute 0 here 0 minus 1 means minus 1 factorial so minus 1 factorial is not defined so that summation is valid from x is equals to 1 to n now it is n minus 1 factorial by n minus x factorial into x minus 1 factorial p power x minus 1 q power n minus x this expression n minus 1 factorial by ncx factorial into x minus 1 factorial can be written as which is known as binomial coefficient n minus 1 c x minus 1 n minus 1 c x minus 1 right now the total expression this one summation x is equals to 1 to n n minus 1 c x minus 1 p power x minus 1 q power n minus x can be written as q plus p whole power n minus 1 or p plus q whole power n minus 1 what is p plus q p plus q is equals to 1 yes this is nothing but summation n minus 1 c x minus 1 p power x minus 1 q power n minus x is nothing but binomial expansion of p plus q whole power n minus 1 binomial expansion of p plus q whole power n minus 1 and p plus q is equals to 1 so you get simply np so mu 1 dash is equals to np mu 1 dash is equals to np hence the mean mu 1 dash we know that mu 1 dash is nothing but mean by expectation by mathematical expectation mu 1 dash is nothing but mean so mean is equals to mu 1 dash is equals to expectation of x is equals to np let us go for second moment second moment mu 2 dash the mu 2 dash is given by expectation of x square square it is given by summation x is equals to 0 to n x square into probability of x 
here this x square can be modified like this x into x minus 1 plus x x square minus x plus x by making x common from these first two terms we get this term x into x minus 1 plus x that is the term here we write x into x minus 1 plus x into probability of x now split the summation split the summation apply summation for both the terms summation x is equals to 0 to n x into x minus 1 p of x plus summation x is equals to 0 to n x into p of x this term is nothing but expectation of x and this term is nothing but expectation of x into x minus 1 so right now calculate the term expectation of x into x minus 1 by the definition of mathematical expectation it can be written as summation x is equals to 0 to n x into x minus 1 into p of x what is p of x here p of x is given by binomial distribution so pmf probability mass function of binomial distribution ncx p power x q power n minus x now let us write the formula for ncx n factorial by n minus x factorial into x factorial ncx is equals to n factorial divided by n minus x factorial into x factorial now let us rearrange all these terms n factorial can be written as n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 factorial and x factorial can be written as x into x minus 1 into x minus 2 factorial and p power x can be written as p square into p power x minus 2 and now these are the terms now you observe that summation runs over x summation runs over x so by making common n into n minus 1 into p square outside the summation so you can write those terms outside the summation because summation runs over x because summation runs over x and also you observe that you observe that here x into x minus 1 x into x minus 1 these two terms are same terms so they get cancelled now what are the remaining terms the remaining terms are nothing but n minus 2 factorial divided by x minus 2 factorial into n minus x factorial so that can be written as summation x is equals to 2 summation x is equals to 2 to n n minus 2 c x minus 2 that is nothing but n minus 2 c x minus 2 binomial coefficient and p power x minus 2 q power n minus x again this is nothing but this summation part is nothing but p plus q whole power n minus 2 p plus q whole power n minus 2 we know that that p plus q is equals to 1 so you get this step finally p square into n into n minus 1 let it be equation number 3 now using equation 3 in equation 1 we get mu 2 dash is equals to n into n minus 1 into p square plus n p let it be equation number 4 now let us go for mu 3 dash now mu 3 dash is equals to expectation of x cube yes this x cube can be written like this expectation of x into x minus 1 into x minus 2 plus 3 into x into x minus 1 plus x so this x cube uh, observe that this is you must practice this term x cube can be written in this form x into x minus 1 into x minus 2 plus 3 into x into x minus 1 plus x by splitting the expectation we get this expectation of x into x minus 1 into x minus 2 plus 3 into expectation of x into x minus 1 plus expectation of x let it be equation number 5 now calculate term by term expectation of x into x minus 1 into x minus 2 is equals to summation over x is equals to 0 to n x into x minus 1 into x minus 2 into p of x what is p of x here here p of x is probability mass function of binomial distribution so it can be written as ncx p power x q power n minus x again what is ncx ncx is equals to n factorial by n minus x factorial into x factorial this p power x can be written as p cube into p power x minus 3 and q power n minus x is as it is now again n factorial can be written as n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 into n minus 3 factorial and this x factorial can be written as x into x minus 1 into x minus 2 into x minus 3 factorial now you observe that x x minus 1 x minus 2 here also x x minus 1 x minus 2 they get cancelled and you observe that summation runs over x so n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 and p cube they write outside the summation 
they have right outside the summation and summation is valid from 3 to n because if you if you write x is equals to 2 here if you write x is equals to 2 in this term you get 2 minus 3 factorial 2 minus 3 factorial what you get minus 1 factorial it is not valid it is not valid it is mathematically absurd therefore the summation is valid from 3 to n nc3 <coughs> excuse me n minus 3 c x minus 3 p power x minus 3 q power n minus x again this summation n c n minus 3 c x minus 3 p power x minus 3 q power n minus x can be written as q plus p whole power n minus 3 so finally we get because of q plus p is equals to 1 because of q plus p is equals to 1 you get n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 into p cube let it be equation number 6 now using equation 1 2 equation 1 3 6 in equation 5 we get mu 3 dash is equals to mu 3 dash is equals to n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 into p cube q plus 3 into n into n minus 1 into p square plus n p now mu 4 dash is equals to expectation of x power 4 that is nothing but summation x is equals to 0 to n x power 4 p power x on simplifying in a similar manner by using previous procedure we get this one mu 4 dash is equals to n into n minus 1 n minus 2 n minus 3 p power 4 plus 6 into n into n minus 1 n minus 2 n into p cube plus 7 into n into n minus 1 into p square plus n p now let us see case 2 case 2 is nothing but central moments case 1 is non central moment case 2 is central moments the central moments mu 2 is given by mu 2 dash minus mu 1 dash whole square mu 2 is equals to mu 2 dash minus mu 1 dash whole square what is mu 2 dash we get this n into n minus 1 into p square plus n p and what is mu 1 dash whole square n square p square n square p square simplify the terms after simplifying the terms n square p square minus n p square plus n p minus n square p square now you observe that these two terms are same with opposite signs they get cancelled so you get n p minus n p square this is nothing but n p into 1 minus p what is 1 minus p 1 minus p is nothing but q therefore n p q mu 2 is equals to n p q which is variance mu 2 is equals to n p q therefore variance v of x is equals to n p q now let us solve mu 3 what is mu 3 mu 3 is equals to mu 3 dash this is the formula you must remember from the moments from the moments so mu 3 is equals to i mean the relation between central and non central moments mu 3 is equals to mu 3 dash minus 3 mu 2 dash into mu 1 dash plus 2 mu 1 dash whole cube substitute every term which is already derived earlier so mu 3 dash n into mu 3 dash n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 into p cube plus 3 n into n minus 1 into p square plus n p up to this term up to this term mu 3 dash and let us go for minus 3 into mu 2 dash into mu 1 dash minus 3 into mu 3 da mu 2 dash n into n minus 1 into p square plus n p into mu 1 dash n p plus 2 mu 1 dash whole cube 2 into n p whole cube you observe one second and simplify all these steps please observe that n p by making n p common n square minus 3 n plus 2 into p square plus 3 into n minus 1 into p plus 1 minus 3 into this term and plus 2 n p square and multiplying and simplifying cancelling every term multiplying and simplifying finally we get this n p into 2 p square minus 3 p plus 1 this is nothing but n p minus 2 p square minus p minus 2 p plus 1 again by, by factorizing by factorizing we get this n p into 2 p into p minus 1 minus 1 into p minus 1 again factorizing we get n p into 2 p minus 1 into p minus 1 this p minus 1 or this p minus 1 and 2 p minus 1 can be written like this 1 minus 2 p and 1 minus p what is 1 minus p 1 minus p is q 1 minus p is q therefore n p q into 1 minus 2 p mu 3 is equals to n p q into 1 minus 2 p similarly mu 4 is equals to mu 4 is equals to mu 4 dash minus 4 mu 3 dash mu 1 dash plus 6 mu 2 dash mu 1 dash whole square 
minus 3 mu1 dash whole power 4. After substituting every value and simplifying, we get NPQ into 1 plus 3 N minus 2 PQ. That's all. These are the moments of the binomial distribution. Remember the fact that, remember the fact that the derivation part is very simple and easy while seeing the video. You have to practice at least once. Then you become familiar about this derivation. So you have to practice at least one time by using paper and pencil. So it is familiar. So keep learning. Wish you all the best.